Welcome back guys, we're here in the professional shop at Blackpool North Shore today and we're looking at the new Ping Sigma 2 putters. Okay, so Ping are obviously advancing on from their Sigma range from last year. They've brought out kind of the same sizes, same types of putter, but there is something they've revolutionised with the golf shaft. So we've got here the answer and the Tyne. We'll have a quick talk about what they're for and what they can do for you. But we have got a few more models in the Pro Shop if you want to pop in and have a little look for yourselves. The big difference between the two putters is the fact that the Tyne is designed to go straight back and straight through. And the actual answer is designed to have a slight curve in your stroke. So again, they have a sticker on the golf shaft that tells you what the putter can do. That's on every single one, it either says straight for the straight back, straight through, or slight for the kind of curved putting stroke. With every Sigma 2, you do actually get the same putter insert on the face. So this is a dual face. What it means is that the black section is actually softer than the blue section that sits behind it. So that's a little bit firmer. The black bit, which is nice and soft, is designed for that feel. Maybe a little bit of touch when you're close to the hole. And the actual blue section is more for your long putt. So you get good distance control as well. Okay, so this is the big hype with the Sigma 2. And that's the adjustable putter shaft. So yeah, you can actually change the grip up and down so you can have it long short whatever you require the way we do that is we use a little tool that they bring out it's like an allen key that sits just in the top of the grip and every turn changes the putter grip by quarter of an inch so it can move up and down by quarter of an inch i believe it can go from 32 inches all the way up to 36 so again that's going to be great for ladies and men and again for myself for custom fitting make sure we get the right height and the right length Okay, so I just want to point out now why you should have the right putter length. And again, Ping are saying 8 out of 10 golfers have the wrong putter length. So it's very important we get this putter at the right length so we can hold more putts. I have though made this putter at 32 inches, so it's very short now. I just want to point out what can go wrong, because this putter is very short for me and probably not the right size. So again, let's just have a little look at my setup when I do this. So what I'm feeling of my eyes are kind of over the ball too much. So again, that can cause a little bit of inconsistency of where the stroke is and what it's doing. My arms do feel quite stretched. So for long putts, I'm not going to get that feel that I'm used to. And I'm also getting a little bit of a twinge in my back. So I'm very crouched over. If I was in this position for more than 10 minutes, I've got a feel I'm going to get a little bit of back pain as well. So let's go ahead now and actually lengthen that putter up to the 36 inch and see what can happen when we do that. Okay, so as you can see, I've actually moved this up to 36 inches now. One thing I'm feeling is I'm very far away from the ball. Completely different to when I had it very short. I also feel like my eyes are more inside the ball now. So again, maybe too much. So that could cause a little bit too much curve on the stroke. And especially with the tine, I don't want to get that curve. So also, I don't actually know what to do with my elbows. So my body's quite upright. I've not quite got that feel. And again, I feel like the toe's slightly off the ground. So I want to kind of push my hands out. So again, a little bit all over the place in my setup. I don't know what I'm doing. And again, it could develop the wrong stroke as well. So let's just try now and get that about 40, 34 inch, which is normally what I have a putter. Okay, so we've changed it to 34 now, and this is the ideal length for myself. I feel like my eyes are directly over the ball. Perfect for that straight back, straight through stroke. Hands and arms are quite comfortable, not too stretched out. I've got a little bit of kind of flex there just to control the speed and control kind of where I want that ball to go and in terms of my setup and posture it feels a lot more comfortable now so for me I can get it straight to 34 you guys might be different though might be taller shorter but with this putter we can get the perfect length for you okay so overall with the Sigma 2 ping putters I'm very impressed with that shaft adjustability it's a great tool for golfers and me as a coach because everybody is different and we need to get that putter length the right size. In terms of the head shape and weight, we can customise that to your stroke. But in terms of length, we've got to take the grip off, cut it down. There's a lot of work that goes into it, whereas now we can just use that little Allen key, twist it a couple of times, and it's the perfect length for you. Don't forget to like the video if you enjoyed it, subscribe to my channel, and we'll see you next time.